Hello, I am Vivek Reggae. I am speaking on uh, tongue tie today, which is a very common uh, problem in children. Now, tongue tie essentially is something which is there from birth and it has been discovered maybe at birth, at one month, at eight months or even sometimes at one year. Now, the common problem is that it is a short frenulum or as they say in Bollywood, Jaban ko lagam hai. Now, in these cases, because there is a short frenulum, it restricts the movement of the tongue and therefore the tongue cannot be protruded out. Now, there is a common misconception that A, the tongue tie prevents a child from speaking, it prevents a child from understanding speech etc. which is totally a wrong conception. Most of the functions of the tongue can be performed in, a, in the presence of tongue tie like eating, swallowing, sucking, everything. Even speaking is not a problem and the only problem is that saying the hard consonants that is t, th, d, those are extremely difficult in the presence of a tongue tie because the tongue cannot reach the palate. And the other important point is after the teething and we are used to cleaning the insides of the teeth after eating with the tongue, that is the other function which probably cannot be done. Now therefore this requires surgery, this requires to be released. But for the sake of speech, only release of tongue tie is not going to be adequate. They have to have a subsequent speech therapy in order to improve their pronunciations. Next. Now, this is uh, the tongue tie which is being released. And uh, most of the times this is done as a daycare procedure. The child comes in the morning, goes home the same day evening. As soon as the surgery is done and the child is out of anesthesia. Usually there is no bleeding next, but sometimes if there is some amount of bleeding because the frenulum is thick or vascular, then we may either cauterize with a bipolar cautery or we take multiple stitches to prevent the further bleeding later on next. Now this is what the final result looks like, that the tongue can be easily brought out next. Now this is another child with a tight frenulum. And as I said, only two things are important to remember. One is the hard consonants and two is cleaning of the teeth from the inner aspect by the tongue. And all this can be achieved by a simple release of the frenulum. Next, this is done usually under general anesthesia because the child will not be cooperative without giving general anesthesia. And the child comes out of anesthesia very rapidly. The only, next, the only uh, what shall I say, precautions to be taken is after surgery of tongue tie, the child is given only liquid diet for the next three days. That also the liquids have to be either room temperature or cold. It cannot be warm or hot milk or any of those things. And secondly, after every liquid feed, they have to gulp down a half glass of water so that nothing of the feed or the liquids stick to the part where the surgery has been done. Other than that, there is no need for any hospitalization or any panic. And therefore, post release of the tongue tie, the child must have a speech therapy to get proper function. Thank you.